and welcome to Higher Ground Gaming. This is Eric. Today we're going to play round three from the Augusta National Tournament using Inside the Cup Golf. Um, Phil Mickelson at the end of two rounds was on top of the leaderboard at 10 under par. We'll see how he can do here. Currently Tiger Woods is in the lead at 9 under par after three. After shooting a 4 under par round three. So let's see what Phil can do here. Um, if he can at least maintain a par, he should should still have uh, the lead but we're hoping for better than that so we'll see as he's teamed up with Trevor Immelman for round three so let's tee it off and get get this underway from Augusta National Golf Club so we're on hole one par four Phil's ready to grip and rip Phil does not have the longest drive but he can occasionally shoot along if he can get an 18 to 20, so we'll see how he can do today. Accuracy is definitely the most important, so we'll see what he can do. So he does get just get in the B range here and in the middle, so very good first drive by Phil. 311 yards in the B fairway here. Trevor Immelman will shoot now, and he'll take a second shot as he we shot further than he did on the first one, so... He will have a 19-foot birdie, part, birdie uh, putt coming up. So let's see what we can do. Phil's got his middle iron. Phil excellent at the short game. He'll six and above. We'll get him on the green. It was a good opportunity for birdie. Oh, he does not. Miss hits it there, and he's going to be off the green. So he's going to be off long. It's like right in here in the in the rough so a little too much club on that one for Phil so he's got his pitching wedge out now Ooh. must have been an adjustment there or something so Phil will have a very long putt for birdie you'll he, need a 196 and above so most likely he is going to par the hole and Immelman has a 19 foot putt for, for uh, birdie. So let's see what Phil can do here. And nope, he'll two putt it, so he will par the hole. So we're off to hole number two. And it looks like, oh, we actually, we ended up bogeying the hole some reason. And Immelman actually, it was even. Maybe I was looking at his score accidentally. Alright, so off the hole two, par five. 575 yards. And it's going to be another B. We'll probably be in, the, be in the B for most of the day. Which is fine. But unfortunately we're off to the left here. But we are still on the fairway. Over here. So, it's doable. And it looks like Immelman is also on right next to us. But we'll shoot first. So we're going to see whether he's going to go for the green or not. And he will go for the green. So he'll need a 13 and above with his wood here. Oh, very nice shot. But we're going to have a long putt awaiting for us. But a chance at an eagle here. We can get a 196 and above, so he's giving himself an opportunity here. And nope, he will get two putted, so we will get a birdie on the hole. So we're back to even. And Immelman is one is under par by one stroke. So mix in with the shot here. It's going to be a whole three par four, 350 yards. And that's going to be in the B range, but it's going to be off to the right and in the rough. Immelman, after a second shot, is facing a 23 foot putt for birdie. And we got our short iron out here. Good shot here by Phil. Should have an excellent shot for birdie here, 152 and above. 
Oh, 39. Not a very good hit by Phil, so he will, he will par the hole here. So I missed the opportunity there. So off to hole number four. We're at even. And Immelman actually ended up uh, birding the hole, so he's at two under now. But his first shot went in the sand. Right over here. So let's see what we can do here. So we'll need a 13 and above. Try to stay out of that sand. Oh, we do not. So I think we're probably going to be on the sand too. No, actually we are not. We are going to be off short. I think we're over here somewhere. Yeah, we're short. So Phil's going to have a chance to get on the green here. Three. All right, so he'll have a good putt for par here. So 100 and above will be a par, and 120, no problem. Sinks that one. And it looks like Immelman also parred the hole. So on to the fifth. Oh, Immelman had a bad shot there. See right in the trees. So let's see if we can do a little better here than that. Oh, very good shot by Phil. Very good. Oh, it's happening off to the right, though. And in the rough, so we're out of the trees anyway. A good distance on that one. Gets the middle iron out, six and above, and just gets that. So, good opportunity here for Birdie. 152 and above. Let's see if Phil can take advantage of this now. And Immelman actually ended up getting his birdie. Oh, 98 will not do it. So another par for Phil. Let's see. Immelman catches a shot on us with the birdie. I mean, uh, increases his lead on us. So it's three under par. So I think Immelman is the leader now, I believe. So Phil not faring well here on the front nine. It's a whole six par three, 180, six and above. A nice shot by Phil here. And Phil facing a 23 foot putt for par. I mean for a birdie. Otherwise he'll get the par most likely. Illumind is looks like he's gonna get a par on the hole. 25. So Phil will par the hole so he cannot catch up here. Does not lose any ground though. So hole 7 par 4, 450. The woman actually dropped a shot there and she didn't, he didn't get his par. So, so we're just two shots behind the woman. Phil ready with his driver. And ooh, not bad. It's actually going to be in the middle there. In the fairway. In the B mid. So a good drive by Phil. Sets us, sets him up nicely for a chance at a birdie. And Immelman right next to us too. So here's Phil with his second shot. Oh, not a good shot though. Three. That is not good at all. So we're going to go over here. So Phil with a chip shot now. 14 and above. Oh, and a bad almost ended up failing it, but he's gonna two putt it. It's not good at all. As it looks like. So Phil with the bogey, and it looks like Immelman. See if he can get the par here. Oh, so he drops a shot too, so he ends up bogeying it too, I believe. So. We're just one shot behind him in the round. I think we may be a shot ahead of him overall, so we may be tied. Uh, actually, shot coming into this ahead of him, so I think we're probably tied with him now. So, hole eight, par five, 570, a longer par five in Augusta here. So, Phil, the 
shoot it, and a good shot by Phil. However, it's going to be off to the left. And he'll be in the rough. And Immelman is C mid fairway. So he'll shoot. Needs a 10 and above from the long iron, gets a 13, so very good. And he will not be far enough, close enough to make the green. So he'll lay it up. Right here. And he's off left into the trees, is Immelman. So Phil with his third shot here. Needs a 4 and above from the short iron. Good shot there by Phil. Well, he'll have a good opportunity for a birdie, 152 and above. Got to start taking advantage of these birdie opportunities here. And he cannot once again, so Phil having trouble with his short game here. And it looks like Wimbledon is also going to par it. So another missed opportunity there by Phil. So far out of our three golfers, Tiger has fared the best in this round three. But still plenty of time here as we're just about to finish the front nine and go on to the back nines. So plenty of golf left here for Phil in round number three to get back in the to uh, get back in the game here and try to open up his lead. So hole nine par four four sixty. And not much distance on that one and off to the left. Some miss hits again. So see what but it is in the fairway, so it's not too bad. And Immelman here in this mid fairway here. So Immelman with a little straighter shot. So Phil with this middle iron here. Oh man, another bad hit. And he's going to be in the sand. So 145 and above. Cannot do it. Still has a chance to one putt it. Oh, and a bad hit there. Almost three putted it there. So that is not going to get the job done. That is a bogey on that one. And Phil will drop to two over par for the for the round as we head to the back nine. And we'll then even through the first front nine. So Phil the tee off, hole ten par four, four ninety five, or longer four par four. Man, bad shot here, but it is in the middle. And Immelman on the green, facing a 35 foot putt for birdie. Phil needs a 10 and above long iron to get on the green here. Gets it. So he'll be facing a 22 foot par, 22 foot putt for birdie. Needs a 191 and above. No, not even close on that one. So Phil will par that hole. As we head to the 11, 505 yard par 4. So an even longer par 4. Nice drive by Phil. B mid fairway. And Immelman is going to be A left in the rough over here. Oh man, another bad hit by Phil. And he'll be approaching the green right over here. So definitely not a good round for Phil. After a very good second round. And he has a chance to one putt it. We'll see. And he will do that. Hey, Miss Mags. Miss Mags is joining us in here. Mr. Brody in here too. Off camera. And that is going to be a... Par. So he saves par. On to num hole number 12. As Immelman actually bogeyed it. He's at plus one. So just one shot behind Immelman. So here's Phil with his middle iron here. Hole, hole 12 par 3, 155. And good hit here. So he'll have an excellent shot at a birdie now. It's got to convert here though. It needs a hundred and above. It does not do it again. It's a very disappointing round here. Unbelievable. So 
So he drops, bogeys it actually, so he's plus two. Definitely should have gotten a birdie on that one. So Phil to shoot here, 13, hole 13, par five, 510 yards, a shorter par five. And he will be off to the left. In the water, that is a killer right there. Oh man. Good shot here though. Blaze it up. Phil just wants to get this hole over with. And then he has a chance to redeem himself and at least get a birdie. I mean, at least get a par here if he can get a 152 and above. Needs this badly. Oh, horrible. Horrible, horrible. Wow. Cannot buy a shot. So Phil having a bad round just like uh, Bubba Watson did. Plus three now. He might be even worse than Bubba Watson was. So this is going to hurt his chances here for a championship. He does have another round to go after this, but does not want to get too far behind here. Still five holes left, though. Hole 14, par 4, 440. As Immelman is in D fairway here. Nice drive, five field. Nice distance, but off to the left. So even when he gets distance, he manages to get off the left, and that's going to be in the trees. Phil with the long iron out as Immelman is in the BL rough. Over here. Oh man, this hits with the long iron. And he'll be off over here. Off long, it looks like, over here. Uh, Phil need, needing to save par here. Gets his pitching wedge out. And he'll have a good chance at a par here uh, if he can get the 152 and above. Man, unbelievable this shooting here. Definitely not up to his snuff. Those capabilities, anyway. We head to the 15th, par 5, 530. Needs to do well on these last few holes. As he's plus 4 now. Alright, good, good start here to hole number 15 for Phil. And then one right there next to him. Phil, let's see if he's going to go for it here. I think he'll go for it. He does. So he's got the wood out. Needs a 13 and above. 19. Very nice shot by Phil. So he'll have an opportunity for an eagle here. So if he can get a 191 and above, he can get that eagle. Most likely, definitely will get the birdie, but 191 would be awesome. No, only gets a 60. But does get the birdie though, so gains a shot there. So he'll pull into no, will still be God that was a birdie. I guess it wasn't. Let's check his scorecard here. Yeah, it does a birdie. Okay, he was plus four. But definitely two bogeys before that are not gonna help him. Alright, off to the sixteenth. Par three, lots of water around this one. Needs a six and above. Oh my goodness. That is absolutely horrendous. Thankfully did not get in the water here. Got a three through nine. A zero through two would have been water, so thankfully he's not in the water. And Immelman's got a chance for a par here. 14 foot putt for par. Fill with a second shot. Nice to get a 209 and above, but we'll take a 114 and above. 156 will do that. And Phil gets himself a par. Two more holes left. It's to finish strong here. Definitely going to shoot over for the day, but nice if you can get a couple of birdies here. A nice long drive. That will be adequate. It's B drive. We'll take that. And. After the second shot, Immelman is in the ATGML. So he'll be over here in the fairway. So Phil needs this six and above. 
And he gets it. Oh, he's going to be close too. So an excellent opportunity here to get birdie. He needs that 100 of a musket. This is a must shot for Phil. Nice. Gets it this time. So that gets him a little closer to par for the day. So two above now as he takes the lead over Immelman. So I think Tiger, if Phil can get a birdie here, he will... He should have the lead, but if he does not... Actually, if he birdies here, he'll tie for the lead. If not, he'll be down by a stroke. So, whole 18 par 4, 465. Needs a long drive here. And, ooh, does not get it. But is in the middle of the fairway, so he's still got an opportunity here. Needs that 10 and above here. No, and that cost him right there. So, Tiger will have the lead after... After this, I believe. So pitching wedge. And Phil needs to sink this one to remain a shot off the lead. 152 and above, and Nick gets it. All right, so I think Phil now will finishes two over par for the day, so that he'll be one shot off the leaders, I believe, which is Tiger. If it's right, I think he's got second all by himself, though. If I'm, if I'm correct here. Round three is complete. So I'll check the leaders here after three rounds. And Tiger Woods, yep. Nine under is the leader. With Phil Mickelson, eight under. So both, these are both our golfers here, in Mickelson and Woods. And uh, Tiger Woods with the best round, out, round three out of the three. Stuart Sink get the best round, 67. We ended up getting a 68, so we will take that, though. So, Mickelson with a 2 over 74 in second place. And 3, 4, 5, 5. Where's Bubba Watson? Bubba Watson is currently in one, two, three, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh place. Tied, well, seventh place. Tied for seventh place. With a whole bunch of other guys. But a lot of golfers in between him and the leaders. So Tiger and Phil with the best shots at, at the championship here. Steve Stricker in third. And then it's at five at seven under. Then Brittany Baird, Stain Birch, Tom Prince Jr. at five under with Ron Whitaker, Trevor Immelman, Jimmy Walker, and Freddie Freddie Jacobson at four under. So thank you for joining us in here from Higher Ground Gaining as we complete round three, getting ready to head for round four, and uh, we'll see who can win the win the. Uh, Augusta National Tournament. Can Tiger Woods prevail? Or possibly Phil Mickelson? Or will be, or will be some other golfer? Stay tuned and see. So take care and God bless. And we'll see you for round four. Bye-bye now.